You know, I always typically let the watercolor dictate for me what type of bait I'm using. If I'm on a clear water lake where, where the water has a lot of clarity and I can see a lot under the dock, I want to use a bait typically for me that doesn't have a lot of action. You know, something that's going to fall fast that doesn't have a lot of action. You know, if you're, if you're trying to flip a bait that has kicky legs or something on it, it's going to slow the fall of it down. And in that clear water, you typically don't want a bait that's falling slow because it gives them fish too long, too, too long of a time to look at it. You want that bait to go in there and fall fast and trigger that reaction bite. Now on the opposite side, if I'm on a lake that has dirty water um, and I'm wanting a bait that has, has a lot of water displacement, um, I'm going to look for a bait that has, you know, kicky legs, um, you know, flappy arms, some type of crawl bait, maybe even a jig, um, something that's going to displace a lot of water. You know, and, and I've always been a guy that likes to flip quarter, five sixteenths ounce when I'm flipping docks. You know, I know a lot of guys like to flip a half ounce jig or maybe even a three quarter ounce jig or something like that. But I just overall, um, I like a quarter ounce or a five sixteenths. I like to be able to skip way back under there, under them docks, and I like to make good quiet presentations, you know. Um, but like I said, for me, it always depends on uh, watercolor, typically on my bait selection. You know, in, in colors, you know, I try to keep them simple as well. Green pumpkins or watermelons, um, when the water's clear, you know, you can add some red flakes, blue flake, whatever you want, but typically green pumpkin or watermelon. When that water gets a little bit of stain or a little bit of color to it, um, you're gonna go with your traditional black and blues, June bugs, just your darker colors. Just kind of remember, I always try to match my bait to the water color. You know, the lighter the water, the lighter the bait. The darker the water, the darker the bait. It's pretty simple.